Hello, son. I represent some business acquaintances of your father's. Uh-uh. <sighs> ah, that is good. I can see this is a well-run home. Nah. Go ahead, pick. Pick whatever you want, man. Don't... The fuck you doing in my house, bro? Anything I can help you with, sir? Now that's what I like to hear. Help me, you most surely can. Hmm, now let me guess. You're too young to be Dale, and Tyler is much taller, or I understand. Which means you must be Jay. I've been sent with a requisition. A what? Is your father home? Just missed him. He's he's the type that tells the truth. Uh huh. <laughs> he was here, but you're too late. Ah, shoot. Now that's a shame, because my employers are most insistent. They sent me to collect a down payment. Huh? Hmm. May I? No. No. Please, I think it's time you went. You know what? You're rude. And I'm out of matches. <sighs> Listen, son. I'm not a violent man, but the people I work for, if your pa doesn't pay his gambling debt, with interest, owing money will be the least of his troubles. That's his problem. He wanted to gamble. Good for real. <laughs> Ain't nothing to do with me. It's his problem. Yes, but sins of the fathers, I'm afraid. Interesting. Swiss? <laughs> The watch. A collector's piece, I think. Yours? No. It's... it ain't worth much. Maybe we can come to an arrangement. If you give me the watch, I'll talk to my employers and explain the circumstances. Consider it a gesture of goodwill. Do we have an agreement? I don't know you, Pop. Fuck that. I don't like my daddy anyway. I don't know him, so what? I, I don't like my daddy. I ain't just gonna get stuff because he asked me uh, nicely. Damn it. Now nah, I overrode. You can right click and take it back if you want. Huh? Right now. Babe. You got three, you gonna use another one? No. You better hurry up. If you gonna do it. Forever. <laughs> Giving up the watch. <laughs> Select it. Um, uh, I. Now that wasn't so hard, was it? Perhaps you're the good apple of a bunch after all. <laughs> Jay, I forgot my damn watch. Hey! I told your people to stop bothering me. Now get off my property and go back to whatever piss stinking hole you crawled out of. You've dug your own grave, Holt. Your families, too. You'll be hearing from us. Bring it on. I see you or any of your shit heel friends back here. I'll burn you alive. You got your watch, though. You let that piece of shit intimidate you? In your own home? The fuck is wrong with you? I'm sorry. Sorry? What does that mean? Jay, where's the watch? I gave it to him. 
Ugh. I was trying to help. Oh, for Jesus Christ's sake, can I trust you to do nothing right? Who was that? Jehovah's Witness. <sighs> oh. Uh -huh. Shit. Jay, what was that? This time, keep your goddamn mouth shut. Fuck no. No. Nah. <clears throat> Bunk that. He wanted money. Jay. For a gambling debt. Ugh. He said there'd be trouble if we didn't pay. Jesus Christ, Bear. Mm. How much? I'll take care of it. How? By walking away? Bear, I'm talking to you. I said it's not your problem. But I'll be left picking up the pieces like always. If all you've got to offer us is trouble, why do you even bother coming home? <sighs> even when we've got nothing, he takes it away. It's all right, Mom. Oh. It's all right. Yo, that's a sniper for real. Yes. Okay, it's gonna be a sneaky thing. In the back. Yeah. Away from the road. <laughs> no fear. Gonna be awesome. Isn't he turning off the lights? He gonna shoot you. Like escaping prison. Basically. Gee, thanks, Sheriff. <laughs> you okay? Couldn't be better. <sighs> hey, where were you sitting? Kind of all over. You check the cab. I'll check the bed. Under the seat. I was checking there first. I was. I clicked first. What? You did. You did. You did. Ugh, disgusting. <clears throat> there you are. Is that what the sheriff wanted? Mm. It's just numbers. Department of Water and Power, $12,000. Mm. East side land holdings, 8,000. There's hundreds of these. What are they, bribes or something? Hey. You all right? It's nothing. Just that we're so caught up in all this shit. Oh, yes you are. Me, the sheriff, my family. If you knew what I've seen the last few weeks, it's all just so messed up. <sighs> Can you leave? It must be hard. Mm-hmm. Because he's a sympathetic. He's a kid. I know I hated my life when I was your age. I was fat. My dad was never around. Mine was. You ever have something you thought about doing, but you knew it was too dumb to actually go do? Sure. I used to be an aircraft mechanic. Fixed up 747s and little Cessnas and everything. But when I was a kid, I didn't want to fix planes. I wanted to fly them. Please, Jay. What I really wanted to be was a flight instructor. Oh. So why didn't you? Don't say family. <laughs> I don't know. When I had my family, I was so happy. I guess I put that dream aside. When you have your family, you will put your dream on hold. 
to take care of them. Maybe I should have tried. I always wanted to be a... That's right. So remember that, folks. Sometimes, you know, going through life when you have a family, you know, your life takes a detour, but that don't mean your dreams are over. That doesn't mean you have to stop. Nah. Just put a pause. Put a pause in it. Put a pin in it. But make sure you get back and do the things you want to do in life and things that you enjoy in life. For real. Real talk. You ever been married? Sure, to Vince's mother. I was too once. She left me, said I drank too much. Wait, oh. that's it. Sharon's bar. Didn't you come through here, what, 15, 20 years ago? Oh. Said you were some traveling salesman or something. Mm -hmm. I am telling you, drop it. Hey, we got it. Well, look at you two. A regular Thelma and Louise. Holy Moses. What is all this? Drug deals? I say political bribes. Could be both. Exactly. Sheriffs are elected, right? With all those names and cash amounts, could, could he be paying out bribes or something? Paying them, taking them, and probably a lot more besides. He's been dirty as a dog for years now. Just can't believe he wrote it all down. Oh. Put me through to the sheriff again. I know. I'm inside it. Dante, it's Sharon. Your little whack-a-mole in here betrayed you. I've got your little black book. And I'll gladly start faxing pages to Channel 10 unless you get me that bus in the next 30 minutes. How long till the FBI gets here? Under an hour. All right, Sharon. You win. Boss, you sure? We could wait him out. Bring the goddamn bus. You she gonna kill them all. Yep, 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 yep. yep. Cops, they shoot first, ask questions later. We all agree. I'm mm. not gonna let you. I hope she keeps on sleeping. Shouldn't be much longer now. How you doing? About Michelle. Worried, I guess. She'll be all right. She's at a hospital now. They'll know what to do. You know, I kept blaming her for everything that happened to me. For things she said after the accident, for encouraging me to take that pet food job. Well, yeah, because she was banging Bruce. But she was just trying to help me move on. You've had a rough year, Vance. I'm sure it was hard for her, too. I know what I want to do about those settlement papers she wanted me to sign. Once we get out of here. Oh? Sue the airline. Hell yeah. Fuck that. I'm not gonna do it. I know where she was coming from, but... I'm gonna hire a lawyer and sue those bastards for all they're worth. Really? Well, in the car earlier, I was just... Giving you a hard time. Huh. No, you were right. It doesn't even matter if I win. I'm just not gonna take it lying down. Huh. Then I'm proud of you, son. You mean... I guess the bus will be here any minute. We can't go home again? Wait, Vince. Grow up. Didn't even realize In how case we don't we make it. Ah, uh, uh, Jesus. Okay, look. My cancer. Oh, this mother... It's not as bad as I made it out. In fact, it, uh, it doesn't- Oh, you asshole. Yes, yes he is. Yes he is. What? <clears throat> A year or so ago, my closest friend Tony passed, and suddenly I was alone in the world. My brother was long gone. I had nobody left except you. But. After everything I'd done, the way I left you, I, I knew you wouldn't let me back in your life unless... He's, he's, he, wow. I think he's a career con man. Yep. Please. It's, 
So the doctor visits the... the chemo options, that CAT scan you showed me? What can I say? If you're gonna lie... You might as well go all in. Remember that, folks. If you're gonna lie, lie right. <sighs> I can't believe I considered letting you move in with us. You have every reason to be angry. But Vince, I am still your father. And I want to be there for you. For Zoe. I walked out on my family, but I can be there for yours. You're all I have, Vince. So I'm coming clean. Can you give me another chance? Damn. Well, you forgave your slutty wife. Wow. Slutty that wife, though? Really? Well, he would have been a slutty husband if he did it, so I'm being fair. For better or for worse. And if you'd asked yesterday, I would have said no. But after tonight... I know I'm a lousy person. People can change, Dad. Just promise you'll never lie to me again. <sighs> mm, I don't know how that's gonna work. My but... word. Mm. Yeah, okay. That's probably your mama over there. Yeah, hi. Is Jessica there? Uh, it's Dale. Dale Halt? Uh, no. The one they caught shoplifting. Yeah. Yeah, that's me. Look, I... I seen you work in that liquor store sometimes, and well... There's that bar near there, you know, the one with the pool table and all? And I just was wondering if... Um... You'd want to go there with me sometime. Well, all right. Uh, it's a date. Why you ask a girl out for a day? You probably not gonna make it over the, through the night. Because he probably won't make it through the night, so he had to get it off his chest. So you stood the girl up, basically. If there's a chance to get butt, you do what you gotta do. I'm done. All right, everybody, on your feet. Listen, everyone. The only way any of us gets out of here tonight is on that bus. Hostages at the windows, us in the aisle. You sure this is gonna work? I won't pretend I'm sure of anything, but I know what this family's capable of. Why is the chassis so low? Huh? Get out of the way! No! Oh, 